In this video, I'm gonna show you this Alpine head unit, model number X008U. So it's an eight inch unit. It has built in nav, has endless features. I'm not gonna be able to show you everything. Right here, here's the navigation. I do not have an antenna connected to it. This has uh, May 14th, 2014 maps. It does come in an SD card. I'll show you where that is in a minute. So yeah, navigation's pretty decent. Not much to show you though. Go into the normal screen with radio, has disc. USB, HDMI, Pandora, more auxiliary, Bluetooth, it has built-in Bluetooth. You do not need an adapter. I'm gonna just activate it, my parking brake sensor so I can, um, if I can get it right, so I can access the settings. Again, too many settings to show you. I'm gonna just quickly go through it. Sound settings down here for all your normal EQ and stuff that you'd usually see. split screen between um, GPS and what you're doing for music. This is just to eject the SD card, but it is right behind here. There's a little flap here you pull open. I'm not gonna take it out. Disc goes up here, very top. And yeah, that's, that's all I'm gonna really show you for the front. Um, it's a pretty awesome deck. Too much to show you, I'm not even gonna bother. but I will turn it off and show you the back of it. The uh the wiring harness is not included on this exact model uh, for this one. Uh, if you buy it brand new, it would be. So you got a uh, FM antenna connection and a Alpine connection there. You got all the AV in and out connection. Again, that none, none of these harnesses are included. You have to buy that. If you bought it new, it wouldn't be like this, but you in this situation, you have to buy that separately. Uh, has HDMI in back there, which is pretty awesome. Pre-out harness here. OEM sub here, USB there. GPS antenna connection there. 
mic connection, data link connection, and then that's where the wiring harness was. Here's the bottom of the deck. It is, if you see here, it is off, the screen is bigger than the actual deck, so you kind of have it set out. These uh, clips here are for a Ford, I think, and it's kind of a custom install that you have to get from Alpine. You have to get all the trim and stuff because of the eight inch screen. It makes it very hard to install in certain cars. But anyways, that's, uh, that's all for the video. Uh, I know I couldn't show you a whole lot because there's too much to show you, but that's it and that's how it works. Thanks for watching.